We're going to use the graph to determine the intervals on which the function is increasing, decreasing, and constant. Okay, so remember we're going from left to right. All right, assume that you have uh, this little person on the x axis and you're walking to the right, and the intervals are only going to come from the x axis, okay, only from the domain. So don't use any of the numbers you see on the y. All right, so let's start. We're all the way to the left as far as we can be, and the graph would probably be down here, okay, and we see that it is increasing increasing all the way to this point right there. At this point, we see that the graph now is decreasing, okay? And it's going to decrease forever, right? If I followed it down, it would be like this. So looking at the x-axis, where is this increasing, okay? It starts increasing at negative infinity. As far back as I can go on the x-axis, it is increasing. So the green starts at negative infinity. And where does the green stop? Well, it stops right here, all right, which is 2. So this thing increases from negative infinity to 2. That's one big interval. Infinities always get a parenthesis. And the 2 here is also going to get a parenthesis because at that point 2, it's not necessarily increasing or decreasing. So put a parenthesis on it. Now, decreasing. Where does this thing start decreasing? Well, it starts decreasing right here at 2. And where does it stop decreasing? It never stops decreasing. It goes all the way to infinity. OK, so I have one interval where it's decreasing, which is the red. Infinity always gets a parenthesis. And in this case, 2 is not increasing or decreasing. That's your transition point. So we're going to put a parenthesis on that. Where is this graph constant? It is not. OK, it's not constant. So here's what the answers look like. Open interval on which the function is increasing. I'll put that in blue. And it's going to be from negative infinity to 2. Decreasing. That is going to be from 2, whoops, that was kind of big, let me try that again. It's going to be from 2 to infinity. And constant, you're going to say it is not constant, or no interval. 